Hey guys, welcome back to our YouTube channel. It's Joe and Tay. I know it's been a long time that we haven't done this. We've been gone for like how long? Maybe a year or so. I don't know. Maybe just under a year. I'm I think sure. a year or two. Yeah. We anyway, haven't vlogged. We're uh, back like we never left. You know, of course. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, guys, uh, why have we been gone for so long? What actually happened? Life. Yeah, man, we got married and, you know, uh, a lot of things happened, which I think... Studying we're gonna, at the moment, Joel is busy I'm, doing I'm, his thing. Well, I just landed my first gig as a content creator, so check it out. Check out my Instagram page. <laughs> and we're not here for that. <laughs> we're going to tell you guys honestly and be very transparent, yeah. you know, and let you guys know what really happened. What I, why have we been gone for so long? But apart from that, today's video... What are we talking about? Our proposal! Yes! You heard it! <laughs> well, we're going to be talking our proposal and we've never shared this video for some sort of reason. No, it's very um, personal to me. I feel like, yeah, that moment for me was extremely personal, especially the things that he said to me and yeah, it was just like such a pivotal moment in my life that I was so hesitant to share even with family members. So now finally we've been married for almost two years. Almost two years. Glory and to God. <laughs> I'm finally ready to share with the world. Yeah, you know what's funny? We're not even wearing our rings. But anyway guys, um this video I've also like yeah it's been very personal to us and you know well, we feel like now it's the right time for us to share it with you guys. So check out the video. Firstly, don't forget to subscribe yeah. if you're new here. And if you are coming back, thank you so much wow, from the bottom of our hearts for coming back. We really appreciate it. Like, each and every one of you guys. Make sure to like and share, share. guys. Comment, comment. Let yes. us know what you guys want to see. And what you thought of the video. Exactly. So check out the video. And don't forget to subscribe guys if you've been part of our growing family share this video with a friend and yeah we appreciate every single one of y'all so check it out a lot of people it happens too quick that they found the wife I know it took me four years but it wasn't me searching for other women it was me finding the wife within you and I know that God has allowed this moment to take place for me to honor you before your family before God that I serve and I know that it was all worth it. And in this very moment, in front of my family, in front of yours, just want to ask you just that one question. <laughs> just that one question. And this is a life-changing moment for us. I know a lot of people say we're too young for this, but I know it's God's will. And I don't know, I don't know. I just want to ask you, if <laughs> a year from now <laughs> would you accept to change your surname to mine? Would you be with me? No. Oh, oh you guys, did you actually say it? <laughs> proposal um man let's talk about it like um it how was the video um well i was going to china at the time so i wasn't really focused on a lot of things i was more focused on my visa and my documents and making sure that i have everything that i need so yeah. my mind wasn't really like you know baby but yeah well for me man like the minute i got the ring uh, i think uh, i sent your brother message i was like i got the ring <laughs> and then i was like yo man like let's do it um and I, there was a lot of things that was going on through my mind emotionally and i believe that i made the right decision in my life to marry this beautiful woman she's been supportive she has helped me big time build up my dreams uh and yeah man um 
the build up was amazing. I remember in the morning I was so excited. I called the backy guy because there was balloons that needed to be in the room. So I called the backy guy. We had to put balloons in the uh, like at the back of the backy. So while we were driving, some balloons were falling. And when we made it to the venue, it was like how many balloons? I forgot. Like it was few. And yeah, yeah. If you see in the video, you see the E. It's like a small, small, smaller one, smaller one compared to the other letters. That's because we're trying to like you know uh, blow up the balloon and it popped. So we had to make plans. Um, we I had to go and buy another E, and that's the only E that I could find at the mall. So yeah. Um, next question. When did you know that this is the right thing? You should know. Oh uh, man, I just knew, like you just have a feeling that this is the right thing that you, you are about to do, you know? Uh, when the heart knows, I think it really knows, like this is just a, something in your say, heart, yeah? I, two weeks after meeting Joel, I wanted to marry him. And I had to wait how many years before you proposed? Three yeah, years? I think it was like About five. Five? We, we met in 2015 and we, I proposed to you in 2019, four years. Four years, yeah. so I had to wait four whole years. Yeah, but some weird reason we actually knew that we were gonna... Well, you knew. I knew. Like you kept on I talking about it. Like, like three weeks down uh, our boyfriend and girlfriend relationship, she was like, oh, we're gonna get married. I was like, whoa! <laughs> Hold on! <laughs> you know you know. It was like scary to me. You know you know. It was like so scary. Like she just knew that we were gonna get married, and uh, here we are. Um, explain the moment within the video because um, there was a part of us that was crying. What did the tears sure. mean? It was. I don't know, sure, like the emotion was so much, I don't even like, only looking back at the video now, I remember like what he said, I was like on cloud nine at that moment in, in time, and it was just like, for me, like a 360 change in my life, because of course, you know, this is a huge, huge moment, um, moving out of your mother's house, leaving yeah. your mom, yeah. now trying to plan a wedding, and your life and still studying all at once it was a yeah. but best decision i've ever made yeah man i mean that moment was just beautiful it was, it was. beautiful like i never thought that i was ever gonna cry you know i always used to tell you that me never <laughs> <laughs> you know i was like never i'm never ever gonna cry but when you're in the moment you just have this flashback on how far you guys how far you, have, you know <laughs> exactly and like we've been through the most man 2016 was a tough year for us i mean we graduated we're in the same class a lot of people thought that we were never gonna get married this so there was a lot of things that was playing in my mind and you know i was just like wow god you know this is the moment i i, I didn't even know what i was saying in that <laughs> moment like no, but sometimes speech was so sweet i'm sure you guys so oh my goodness. yeah like you know it's just like i had a whole speech but when I, the minute i saw her i was just like God damn. <laughs> <laughs> you know, the speech and out and I just spoke from the heart and it was just beautiful. Yeah. Um, the moment was beautiful. So yeah, I mean, as so you guys can see. Who are not there, firstly, when I first envisioned my proposal, I always told him like, I just wanted to be the two of us because it's such a special moment and all those things. but. Him having like my mom, my brother, my sister, my brother-in-law, my sister-in-law and from his side as well, my yeah, in-laws, yeah, yeah. I think that is really, really nice. I didn't ever envision it to be like that, but it was so nice that we got to share that moment with everyone, especially my mom, you know? Yeah, true. And at first, I honestly just wanted to keep with the two of us. Because your family knew, everyone knew that, you know, I was going to propose to you. But I just wanted to keep it between the two of us because that moment was so, you know, uh, precious to me really, and really. priceless, you know. So I just wanted it to be the two of us because because of the things that we have been through. Mm -hmm. So it will make more sense to us. Uh, but then again, I thought of it, you know, um, to have your family uh, and people, you know, that way they meant a lot to us. and. Yeah, man, that is just a beautiful moment. So, 
what advice would you give to somebody that's getting ready to propose right now like okay yeah. that's a question for you what advice um man i don't know to each his own you know what they say like mm. i don't think what works for me will ever work for you but if i can share a piece of ad advice i'll just say pray about it that's the best thing that you could Make do. Make sure. Yeah, pray about, about it. If you have a spiritual okay. father or mentor, or people that guide you in life. For me, because I'm I'm such a spiritual person, so I had like my spiritual father, my mentors, my dad that I had to speak to before I proposed. You know, they gave me advice, and we prayed about it. And I, honestly, I was convinced from the heart that you know. Um, this is the right thing to do and you know there's there's such a power with conviction conviction is it's something that comes within so when you believe from within ah, man come on there's nothing that can ever stop you i mean look at this beautiful woman who, who wouldn't want to snatch her out of the market you know <laughs> so i had to do the right thing um yeah i mean well on your side what's the best advice that you can give to a young couple um. This in terms this? of proposal, I can't say much because I knew that, like everyone is different in my opinion, but I knew from literally day one that this is my husband and yeah, that was always in my mind. I never ever pictured Joel as my boyfriend, to be very honest with you. He was like a bit scared in the beginning because he was like, whoa, <laughs> this girl <laughs> is going so fast. Yeah, but yeah, we are like almost six years later. What was that? My ear, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, yeah, we are almost six years later and yeah, we are, I wouldn't say living our best life, but we're getting there, we're enjoying each other's yeah, presence, I mean, we're living in the moment, you know, it's just beautiful. getting to know each other, building our little home that we have here and yeah, it's just, it's, it's amazing bliss. man it's amazing it's, it's amazing I, I would advise like if you feel like you know what i want to get married do it it's all about you no one else and it's so beautiful when you build up from from scratch yeah. like from nothing and you know get to where you want to be you'll see god in the process yeah. and the process so, is yeah. such a beautiful thing so nice and teaching milestones and exactly like you know your person it's we, just we celebrate the different. small wins yeah. exactly you celebrate the small wins more yeah. and it means so much to you yeah. so marriage is such a beautiful thing i know it's like it's an amazing what are you throwing <laughs> <laughs> are you, oh okay now nah, it's such an amazing thing so yeah guys that's the end of it and um i hope you guys really enjoy watching this video i enjoyed making this video for yeah. you guys so, please don't forget to subscribe if you're new here once again if you came back, oh guys, thank you so thank much. Thank you so I much. I appreciate you. I appreciate your like that you're about to give us. Your don't comment, forget to comment, yes, comment, yes, yeah. don't forget to comment, comment as well. And we on the road to two hundred subscribers. We on the road to two hundred subscribers. So. I don't know if we're gonna do a special giveaway when we get to two hundred subscribers. So please. The hint is in my T-shirt. Yeah. Let's go. Please get us to 200 subscribers and we're going to do an amazing giveaway. We'll be back with another video. video. Peace. Mwah. You know, I have to do the peace okay. like You that. always do peace. Peace is so lame. <laughs>